All right, jumping into Stardew Valley. It is, I believe, day nine, according to my spreadsheet. Is it day nine? Yes, it is. All right, so here's what we got to do today. Uh, I need to ship a bunch of stuff. Um, I need to... Oh, yeah, this is... So today is a bit of a thing, so I need to... Okay, ship a bunch of stuff. Whatever I, whatever I have that I can ship, I need to ship. Uh, I need to mine... Because I'm pretty sure I've hit level 40 in the mines. So I need to mine until I get enough iron to upgrade my pickaxe. Then go see Clint, upgrade my pickaxe. And then if there's time after that, I need to buy some parsnips. Uh, go to the community center and then do some fishing. That sort of thing. That is the current plan. So we're going to do some shipping. I just remembered I have a, I didn't install, did not install S Mappy. I need to write that down. Uh, somebody remind me to install. I'm going to just email myself here so I don't forget. Uh, anyway, so a lot of stones got to swing by when you're ready to do it. Oh, for a well. Okay, I don't really want a well, though. Uh, if, that's right. I passed out last night. That's 75 gold. Okay. So, just going just gonna, to just gonna take, take some notes here. Give me a second. All right, install smappy. For anyone watching this on YouTube after the fact, I reinstalled Windows on my computer today. So many things are not working. And screenshot mod. So it takes a screenshot of my farm every day. Okay, so shipping it. Let's ship it like, I don't know, something. Uh, what, to, to, okay, so, okay, let's have a look uh, here. So I need to ship. Uh, looks like uh, some copper and some iron. Great, I can do that. I need to ship a refined quartz, probably, I'm guessing, and an iron or copper bar. And have I shipped sap, cave carrot? Uh, is cave carrot even on here? I don't even know. I think it is. There. No, that's amaranth. Duh. Cave carrot. Cave carrot? Anyone? I might just ship one anyways, just for fun. Okay, let's let's go ship some stuff. So we're gonna ship a piece of copper, piece of iron, copper bar, refined quartz. Uh, ship a cave carrot. Pretty sure I've shipped a sap, coal, rice shoots. If I even need to, sap yes, coal no. Rice shoots. I mean, I'm not seeing it, so I'll ship one anyways. And a piece of coal. I shipped a cave carrot already. Have I shipped a green algae, dandelion, spring onion? I think I need to ship a spring onion still. Um, yes, I need to ship a spring onion. I need to ship... Uh, what was it? I'm not shipping the yam. I must remember to not ship the yam. Did I ship a bug steak, I wonder? I shipped bug meat. I have not shipped bug steak. I'm pretty sure I gotta ship a bug steak. I'm pretty sure, oh, there's a cave carrot. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do it just to be safe. So, but that's not what I wanted to do. I want that one. Uh, ship a crab one. Uh, no, I need that for the community center. Yike. Have I shipped a hardwood? I don't know if I need to ship a regular quartz or not. Can't remember if I've done that. Mm, have I shipped hardwood? Yes. Okay, Um, I might just go with this for now. Because I'm not sure... Ship a dandelion. Oh, I've not shipped a dandelion. Okay, let me do that. Uh, I'm not sure... Like, there might be stuff I don't need to ship, which is kind of worrisome. Because <laughs> I don't know if... Like, I don't want to be shipping stuff if I don't need to ship it. I mean, part of me is... Wants the money, but part of me is like, well... Like this green algae I have. Do I need to ship a green algae? I can't see it on here anywhere. I can't see the silhouette. Let's ship it just to be safe. Okay, I think everything else is good. I'm going to see if I've put a crab in the community center already. I don't think I have. I have not. Okay. Um, What's this? I'll reach the bottom of the mine. Okay. Okay, we're doing well. Hello, Crimson Potato God. Almost have much room in your center. Your life's older than the trees. You know, like a breeze. Oh, older than the trees. Wait, why are my ears burning? Okay, so I think we're good. Do I need to ship a topaz? Um, 
Do I need to strip a toga? Uh, anybody know if I need to strip, strip a tokas? I must do, right? Like, surely. Surely. Surely you can't be serious. I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Uh, have I shipped a stone? Stone? Yes, okay. <laughs> Uh, okay, so all of this stuff, that's community center, Topaz is not, uh, a copper bar is, Yam is, Cave Carrot I'm pretty sure is, uh, I'm pretty sure I need a Cave Carrot for the exotic foraging bundle, I do indeed. Uh, everything else I think can just stay behind. Save that, save the Topaz, I can't remember why. Don't think I need the copper bars today. Don't don't need the slingshot. Can leave the horse radish. Can't remember why. Oh, you know what else I did? Is I updated my spreadsheet. Um, I updated my spreadsheet so it actually has it's actually accurate now. It tells me how many how many things I need to have handy. Uh, so like for example, wild horseradish. I've, I've done stuff with a bunch, but I still need to have two handy, and I've got three, so I can actually eat a couple of them. Uh, great. How about cave carrots? What do, I need, what do I need for cave carrots? I am serious, and stop calling me Charlie. <laughs> what do I need for cave carrots here? Uh, one for a bundle. Two, three, four, five, six... I've shipped one, so it should just be six. It should just be six. So I'll save all those. Uh, we're gonna save the sap. Um, I'm gonna hang on to the bug meat. I can eat the those horse radishes. I can eat the spring onions. I can keep the coal on me. We'll keep the quartz on me to smelt. Anything else I need to take to the mines? I don't think so. Oh, I need to water my plants today, though. Whoops, that would have been bad. All right, let's water. Let's do it. Ooh, you know what I just realized? <laughs> At least one of us just realized, is my animation canceling? Oh, I might be okay. All right, I think we're all right. Okay. There we go. I may have slightly forgotten about that. Anyways, how is, how is everyone's weekend? So, if you follow me on Instagram, I don't think anybody in chat does, which, I mean, fair enough. But, um, I did post what I thought was a rather humor humorous group of stories yesterday. Basically pointing out the fact that it was gorgeous yesterday. It was, like, 26 degrees Celsius. Um beautiful sunshine, like not a cloud in the sky kind of sunshine. So Diane and I got outside, we played pickleball for an hour, you know, went down to the park, went for a bit of a walk for a little bit, got some ice cream. Um, and uh, yeah, in the, in the hour or whatever that, um, um, that we were outside, I mean, the farmer tan is real though. Like, I, I wonder if I could even show you guys. No, it's not great yet. So I have, I've intentionally, almost swing temperature. Oof, it was beautiful out. Um, I have, um, so I was wearing my ankle socks as, as you do, as I was doing all last year. And uh, even just being outside for the hour, like I look and I was like, I can see the tan line on my ankle. And I showed Diane and she was just like, what? what, what? <laughs> look at the little question I already did to you. Yeah, I'm going to be blacker than the Ace of Spades here by the end of summer. That's my goal. That is my goal. Oh, my chat's up. I should pull my chat up properly here. Should have brought... Oh, the sweet, my fishing pole's here. I'm going to take that with me in case I need to make some... Whatchamacallum? Stairs. Is there anything else I want to leave up here? Yeah, I'm going to leave the quartz up here, I think. Food, food, food. Potentially food if I get enough bug meat. 
that can stay here. Everything else is probably fine. Okay, I'm just gonna throw this in here and head down the mines. Level 40, let's do it. Huh. Out of practice. I have a. I thought I had a magnet ring on. I was probably in a, a previous failed attempt or when I had to reset my days or whatever. I should probably check for. Uh, do a little ladder check before I get too crazy breaking rocks. Ah! There we go. So I'm looking for iron as well. I gotta find some iron here. Ooh, magnet ring. Speaking of magnet ring. Nice. That's gonna make life way easier. That's awesome. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna be kind of tempted. How much coal do I have? I've got lots. I'm gonna if I get enough um, iron. Huh. If I get enough iron, I'm gonna be tempted just to go and. Uh, go get my tool upgrade right away. Because I still gotta stop by um, Pierre's and grab some uh, some seeds and stuff. So I've got 20 right now. I mean, I need 25. I need 25 uh, iron. There's 23. Any more iron on this level? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Gotta eat something here too pretty soon. Ooh, dwarf scroll, huge. Uh, let's eat a... Oof, how many leeks do I need? Because leeks are kind of hard to come by. I still need four. Oof, I'm just gonna eat the horseradish. I'm gonna save the leek. And we're going to eat both horseradishes and all four. Uh, all four cave care spring onions if we need to. And we do. The unfortunate thing is that uh, I'm still low on energy, so hopefully. Okay, so it's noon. Ooh. Yeah, you know what? Forget this. I'm gonna go get these iron bars smelting because they take a couple of hours. I may not have time. Unless I can make another furnace or two. Pro uh, hmm. uh, how much copper would I need to do that? 20. Okay, let's try and get some copper. <laughs> and maybe if we're lucky... There's no copper here. Maybe if we're lucky, I can... Uh, make another furnace, and then... I can't remember the luck today. I didn't actually check the luck. Apparently it's not great. Okay, so the pickaxe is not happening today. Um, because I just don't think I'm going to get enough copper. Uh, yeah, and you know what, I, for the, with the energy that I have, I don't think I even care. So what we're going to do instead is, um, we're going to, what are we going to do? I mean, I guess fish, so I can get some food for energy for food. Oh, I'm gonna eat the bullhead, I guess. 
That'll give me a little bit of energy. Maybe I can try and get down five more levels in the mine. See if I can get to level 50. And then, uh... That's too bad. I was really hoping to get this upgrade today, but... Oh well, I'll have to wait for tomorrow. Wow, a lot of rocks. A lot of rocks going on right now. Okay, you know what? I think I'm gonna give up. <laughs> like, this is, uh... Yeah, this isn't gonna happen. I'm just gonna go grab these, uh... Have a bit of uh, coal here. Take this ladder because it's closer, but I'll grab the frozen tear just because, just and maybe the iron just because. But I'm gonna be. It must. I think. I think it might be like mildly bad luck today. I don't think it's worst luck, but I think it might be sort of slightly bad luck. I hope Pierre's closes at five, by the way, because if Pierre's closes at four, I'm not gonna make it. Which means it's another day, which I guess not the end of the world if all I'm looking for is parsnips. It's not the end of the world if I don't get the parsnips in today. Whoops. Alright. Alright, let's go to Pierre's. And, uh... If I can make it. Hopefully he closes at 5. Can't actually, can't remember. Um... Go to Pierre's, buy some parsnips. I'm going to use my sap for basic fertilizer, just trying to get some gold star parsnips. And then, um, shouldn't have come this way, that's a mistake. I mean, that's okay. If Pierre closes at five, then I'm okay either, either way. Yes, okay. So, Pierre, let's talk about this for a second. Let me just go back to here. Uh, it just says buy parsnips and plant with fertilizer, so let's do that. Let's pick up some parsies. How many do I want? Ooh. I already have so many plants, I really don't want to grow too many more, but I need to start getting my farming up. So I've got kale on the go, so that's going to help when it does happen. Here's a question. Does farming... It, um... The higher level of farmer you are, does that give you a better chance? Crop quality frequency. I was thinking, does it give you a better chance to get higher quality crops? Farming level, regular quality. It does. It totally does. So I might just wait on, on the parsnips. Because honestly, like, what's my farming level right now? Uh, farming level is one. So even with farming level one, there's only a 6% chance of getting something that's silver quality. So maybe I'll, I mean, I'll pick up, I think it's still money though, because how many parsnips do I still need? I still need, or do I need any? I don't need any. Um, and it's the ninth. I got. I want to buy some strawberries on the 13th. 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh, but parsnips, even parsnips take four days. Ooh. But I'll have some, hmm. Pierre, his bladder's empty. Yeah, Pierre's a bit of a, a bit of a pee. Uh, he's a bit of a dick. He's just like, I mean, okay, it's like, you know, you want to support local business and stuff like that, but, like, all the dude cares about is money. It's like, dude, like, spend some, you have to spend some time with your wife. Caroline could do so much better. Although I read somewhere that, that I guess there's some dialogue in the game that suggests that the wizard is actually Abigail's father. I'd have to, I'm not sure. I, I'm not sure that this is just, you know, this is just speculation, but there is a, some suggestion somewhere that Pierre is not necessarily... Abigail's dad. I'll have to investigate further. Okay, so, uh, I mean, I'm here now. Do I take the chance? 
and buy some parsnips. So here's the problem with that. If we look at the crop planner, if I get the parsnips planted today, oh, they're done on the 13th. But I won't have the money from them though, because I could pick them that day. I, won't, I don't think I'll be able to sell them to Pierre at the egg festival. But I mean, I'll have a couple days of mining, or at least another day of mining, potentially. Or I might have to have to fish for money, I guess. I have to decide how many. Uh... Oh, I don't know what to do. Do I... okay? If I buy parsnips now, that's going to be more energy spent. There is the raid from L. Kearney. Thank you very much for the raid. Appreciate that. What were you just doing? Playing Fortnite? Excellent. How is it going? Thank you very much for the raid. I appreciate it. Hello, Lee Hansen. Hello, L. Kearney. Thanks for stopping in. Thank you for the raid. Hello, people coming in from L. Kearney's stream. For those of you who don't know me, my... thank you, Lee Hansen, for the follow. For anyone who doesn't know me, excuse me, my name is Paul, which you can tell from the, you know, how I handle. Uh, hello. Con... Dre is con queso. Took me a second. Hello, Ashley Joe. Yes, my name is Paul. I'm a variety streamer, although I do a lot of music streams. Although that being said, I'm going to be playing a lot of Stardew for the next while. Bit of a thing. But thank you for the raid, El Kearney. Appreciate that. I, I have a bit of a dilemma on my hands right now. I'm trying to decide if I want to... I'm just going to buy some. Let's buy like... Eight. Just buy 16. All right. Uh, how was, uh, how was Fortnite, El Kearney? Any progress on the mixing front? Not a sausage. No problem. My friend was just asking what Stardew Valley was, so, 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 easy way to show. Oh, for sure, yeah. So this is, um, I'm doing a challenge run, which is a little bit different than normal, than you'd normally play it. But, um, I am the friend. Well, Stardew Valley is a fantastic game. Um... I'm I'm doing a challenge run, so I'm taking it a bit more seriously and like trying to do but accomplish a bunch of things by certain days and whatever. But if you're just playing it casually and just doing whatever, there's a ton of stuff. It's a super deep game. It's super well put together. Um, I mean, I can't say enough good things about it. It is pretty awesome. Fortnite was good. Won quite a few ranked matches. Very nice. Very nice. So yeah, one of the, um, oh, so yes, Blackbird Jam Studios, I was going to work on it a bit today, and um, uh, didn't because uh, I decided to reinstall Windows on my desktop, and Windows is not, the, re the reason I'm playing a video game right now and not doing a music stream like I was going to do on Sunday is because um, there's nowhere near being ready. Um, <laughs> It's nowhere near being ready for me to, uh, to, to do music. Have to install my side. It, yeah. Things have gone poorly today, so I had to reinstall. Not only, I had to reinstall twice. And, um, I am now just, I, I was, it was easier to get Steam installed than it would be to get my music software plugins and everything installed to do that. So yeah, music will happen off stream this week, I think. Uh, the meme is about getting home before 2 a.m. on Stardew are hilarious. It's funny because I just realized I'm really low on energy. Ooh. All right, let's go, get, let's go get some food. How much energy do I have? 17? Maybe I can catch a fish or something. Um. Anyways, well, here's the thing, Al Kearney. I mean, you know, you you were uh, you were, you were playing Fortnite, and you got a bunch of uh, ranked matches wins, but um, it's not really hype. It's not really hype. You should ask me why it's not hype. I'm glad you asked. Because the hype is real. Okay, 
Um, favorite thing to use shadow points on any stream <laughs> to get whatever animations this dude's got. Uh, so yeah, Stardew Valley. Many things to do in Stardew Valley. Um, things such as farming, as you see. There's lots of villagers and people to meet. Um, and to build relationships with and get married. It's a lot like Harvest Moon. If you've played a Harvest Moon game, uh, apparently it's a lot like, people say it's like a lot like Harvest Moon. I haven't played Harvest Moon myself, but that's what I'm told. Uh, there's fishing involved, which I'm about to do because I need the energy to live and do stuff. And I'm going to eat a spring onion or two, just to make sure I don't lose my own. But yeah, no, it's a super great game. I, I recommend Stardew Valley to anyone who likes just really chill. Um, it can be really chill. You can do challenge runs. You can do money challenges. You can do whatever you want. Like, it's it's pretty sweet. It's time for bed, you boy. Have a good stream. Have a good night, Dr. D D Drez Conqueso. Thanks for stopping in. Still gotta, get, still gotta reach level 10 fishing. Uh, but yeah, so yeah, the, me doing this fishing stuff right now is just purely because you can see my energy down here in the corner is at super low, so. Um, but yeah, what I'm doing is, uh, this challenge I'm doing, it's, uh, there's, it's sort of, it's sort of like 100% completion, but it's, there's an in-game... Um, thing called perfection that you can reach, where if you accomplish certain things, um, it will say you have reached perfection in the game. Um, and uh, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do it by the end of the second year in-game. So, um, yeah, it should be doable, shouldn't, shouldn't be an issue, hopefully, if things go well. We'll see. But, uh, but yeah. That's what my challenge is. So there's still, and I, like, I'm just, this is the, the ninth day of spring of the first year, so I'm just starting out. Uh, I enjoyed the fishing in Zelda. I don't know if I ever fished in Zelda. But yeah, Stardew's a great game. I def and it's available for everything too. Like it's available on mobile and on Switch and on like pretty much everything. So highly recommend it. All right, let me finish watering my crops. Oops. Oh, one short. All right, I'm also gonna grab my axe and uh, what can I put away right now? I've got stuff on me I don't need. Clay can go. Um, how many daffodils do I need to have on me right now? I need one. Okay, shouldn't that be in here though? Oh, that seems strange. Why do I have... Why does it say I need... Okay, hold on. What do I need daffodils for? Uh, oh, two is funny for that. 10 pound catch for a kid, 20 for an adult. So for daffodils, you need one for a bundle, which is done. Wild seeds is done. Ship is three is done. And then one for a quest. So yeah, I just need to have one. Right? So let's leave that one there. The rest of them I can sell. Um, I can't go to the museum anymore because it's too late for that. Uh, leeks. I should put the leek in there as well. Um, fish I can eat. I should go and... Oh, crap. Uh, no, it'll be okay. I was thinking I should go and do the finish the iron ore, but it should be fine because the ones that I put in earlier will be done, and then I'll go there in the morning and put in the last ones. Not ideal, but what do you do? So that goes to Gunther. That goes to Gunther. That goes to Gunther. Um... Keep the watering can on me. Geodes. I need geodes for a bundle, actually. I need a frozen geode for a bundle, so I'll put that in there. Uh, what am I taking to the... I should go to the community center, actually. That's what I should do. 
can't really do much else today. Cause I'm a little short on time. So, let's not go to the museum, but let's go to the community center. Let's drop those off. I'm going to keep this stuff on me for food. Keep that on me for food. All right, so what am I taking to Gunther? Anything in here? No. No. Anything here? Yes. Aquamarine and Rafael Frozen Tear. Uh, oh, but wait. I need I need a frozen tear for a bundle. That's more important. So we'll take the aquamarine, take the dwarf scroll. Why is my nose itching so much? This is bugging me. Wait, no, I'm not going to the museum. I'm going to the community center. Right. So yam, cave carrot, crab. I don't think I need the frozen geo to the frozen tear yet. I don't think I have because those are bolton board bundles. Correct. Um, what else? Uh, clam. Um, I don't think I'm taking any fish with me. Anchovy, bream, carp, chub, flounder, herring, largemouth, sardine, smallmouth. That's that one. That's that one. Taking a couple things for that. Uh, nothing there. Don't have any of those. And I don't have that one. Okay. So I guess this is good. We'll go to the community center. Um, then we'll drop some stuff off. And then we'll head up to the mine. So like, maybe I may put in the last bit of uh, mine. Nose is itchy. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Then we'll go head up to the mine. And, um, we will put in the iron. And then head home. <laughs> head home by that point, because I've got to be in bed before 2 a.m., hopefully. I don't want to lose any more money, so I should really make make a point of... Uh... There's there. I should really make a point of, uh... you know, getting home. Not that I'm going to lose that much. I'll lose, like, 40 gold, but... Okay, uh, so what, where is, where's the yam go? Yam the fall one? There we go. Um, and then a cave carrot's going to be exotic foraging, I think. Stupid flounders. <laughs> okay, there we go. Um, <clears throat> so it's 11 p.m. I'm going to take my chances. Should I take my chances? I probably shouldn't take my chances, should I? Let's do it. Let's take, I'll take my chances. Let's see if I can make it up to the mine, put in the remaining iron, and make it home before 2 a.m. With normal speed, no speed buffs. I mean, if I have a bit, a bit of extra time, maybe I'll try some fishing. I don't know if I can fish on my on the wilderness farm. That is a good question. That can stay there. I might just leave these guys here because I still gotta do some mining. So I'll leave the stone behind. Um, food cover. That I need to sell that daffodil. Uh. Take the slime with me, I guess. I guess I could clean some stuff out. Take those. Quartz can stay. Geodes. Yeah, I can take geodes back, because I'm going to be doing... Uh, I'm going to be doing... Um, you know. When I go see Clint... Wait. Do I need an Omni Geode for a bundle? Or, like, any geodes for a bundle? Uh, gifting tent, so no, no for that one. Omni geode. Doing it for a bundle. I don't think so. Maybe not. No. No, we don't. Okay. 12 a.m. Okay, I will make it home. I will make it home. <clears throat> um, okay. So that was kind of a waste of a day. But it was a bad luck day, so it was, you know, wasn't great. Um, but, I mean, what did we accomplish? We got the iron we need to be able to upgrade the pickaxe, so that's good. Um, and I think this is going to work out... Oh my god, 
I think it's going to work out pretty well because if I look at the calendar again, it's the ninth today. If I put in, actually, I should not put in my pickaxe until the 11th, I guess, because the 13th is going to be a write-off. I don't want to get my pickaxe back on the 13th. If I put it in on the 9th, it would be one, two, the, I'd have it back on, if I put it in today, I'd have it back on the 12th. Excuse me. So yeah, I don't want to put in my pickaxe until the 11th now. I kind of missed that, missed that cutoff. Up, oops, day 11, upgrade to steel pick. Okay, so we ships a bunch of stuff. Um, we bought some parsnips, did the CC drop off, and I guess we're just doing some fishing. So now we're just going to fish until uh, sleep time. I really need to make some money, though. I need to get the, uh, the fruit cave going. That's a bit of a problem. Um, I wonder if I should ship an iron bar. I put two more in, so I probably could. And I do need to, but I do need one for the community center, so let's just leave one there. Okay, and then hang on to the slime. And, uh, is there bat wings over here? No, okay. There is fiber, though. So there's some fiber. Um, frozen geodes for a bundle. Got some wood. I need some wood for a bundle, too, but we'll Deal with that later. I'm going to sell the daffodil. How many earth crystals do I need? I know I need one for like a mayonnaise machine or something. Or like a... Oh. Uh, okay, so we need one for a bundle. One for a mayonnaise machine. Ten for the earth obelisk. Wow. Okay, we're keeping all the earth crystals. Unless I have to ship one, but I don't think I do. So we'll, sh we'll sell the daffodil. And I think we'll be good for the night. Store the sap. Sell the daffy. Go to bed. Alright. What was the luck today? Just out of curiosity. Yeah, mildly bad luck. Hopefully tomorrow's a better luck day. We can do some mining, make some progress. Alright, life elixir. Got that. That's good. Okay. <clears throat> I always save... Oh, I save a cast. I always save earth crystals. Well, you only need whatever that number of 12 or whatever it is. No. 13? 12 or 13? Hold on. What is it? 10, 11, 12, 13 if you need to ship one. Maybe 14 because somebody might ask for a... Somebody might ask for one on a, on a quest. So... Yeah. So tomorrow, sunny, luck is another mildly bad luck day. And a little rerun of the Queen of Sauce. There we go. Gets the door, gone fission. <laughs> All right. Just realized that because the my... Uh... My... Because my plugin isn't installed for the... Uh... To take an automatic screenshot, I should gotta remember to take screenshots now. Alright, let's water some stuff. No, actually, I don't know what else I'm gonna do. It's that. There we go. That's long overdue. Why do I have these parsnips on me again? I'm pretty sure I have all the parsnips that I need. CC. No, I've done the spring. Cry. Yeah, it's the one the one thing I have in there. Oh, I think I was planting extra ones for the um, quality crops bundle. I need to get some, uh, some some gold stars. Not that I need to, but I figure if I can get lucky and get some gold stars before. Um, who am I? Rice shoots are ready. If I can get some gold stars before summer, then that'll make it easier later in life. Let's 
So hopefully I'll at least get, well, five, actually. Because <laughs> if you don't get all five, there's no point in me keeping the few that I'm going to have. Now that I think about it. All right. Crops are watered. Going to grab myself some of this, some of these. There we go. Got to ship at least one of them. Nothing else down here, is there? No. Okay. So we got to ship one of these. Ship them all, really. Um, I guess I could probably sell the parsnips. I don't think I need them. I'll sell those two. I guess maybe I'll keep that one for food because I'm gonna need to. Gonna need food. Because now we're gonna go do some mining. Leave that behind, leave that behind, leave that behind. Take that, take that, take that, take that. Take that, take that, take those. Okay, let's go do some mining. Try and get down the mines a little farther. And then, I mean, that's kind of the next, where's the dog? Oh, there's a dog, hiding behind a tree. Uh, and then how much money have I made? Nine grand, yike. I gotta make 20, five to unlock the cave i think which is unfortunate because i'm not selling anything right now i'm trying to keep everything for I'm trying to keep everything for uh whatever i need it for I was also thinking about who to marry because again, this is a challenge run, so my, my decision on who to marry is completely practical. Um, okay, we've got, I think we have all five bars now, so that's good. I might keep them on me so I don't forget. That's food. And stone, just in case I need to make a stair if I'm really desperate. All right, let's see how far we get. Um, that was a waste. So yeah, anyway, so Yeah, my decision on who to marry is completely practical because it's Yeah, I need to I need to marry somebody because I need uh, to get all the star drops. So I was thinking about marrying Maru because Maru loves diamonds. And uh, I mean, Maru's always been a bit of a pick anyways, to be fair. Um, if I'm entirely honest. Maru's always been a bit of a pick. I would normally tend to want to marry Leah. Um, but... Uh, I have to think of it in terms of what's going to be the easiest to give gifts to. And so since Maru loves diamonds, and eventually I'm going to have enough crystallariums to not have to worry so much about it. Um, I'm thinking Maru. I was thinking either Maru or Penny. But I can't remember why I, I went, decided to go away from Penny and toward Maru. If I'm honest. We'll have to see. It's, good, it's probably going to be one of the two of them. Because I know they both love diamonds. But it'll, it'll de it might depend on... Um, who I can... Uh, there we go. Who, I'm, who I can develop a friendship with first. Like... Well, wow, this is this day is not going well. It's 12 10 p.m. and I just hit my next level on the mines. Yeah, it's a big one too. There we go. Bit of copper, useful. Oh, I need to eat something before I pass out. That's going badly. I'm sorry if anyone's triggered watching me scratch my nose. My nose is super itchy tonight, and I have no idea why. I 
wonder if it was like I got some. I had some very spicy pizza for supper, so maybe might be some spice got into my nose or something. There we go. Long, 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 long hairs here. To sneeze. Excuse me. Normally I would mute that. I missed the button. I couldn't remember what button to hit. Oh, wow, this day is not going great. Forty-eight. Oh, forty-nine. All right, uh, one second, I'll be back momentarily. I'm gonna try and like punch myself in the face. Hold on one sec. All right, so. Crisis squirted. Ooh, quality retaining soil. What did I just get? Mixed seeds, iron ore, okay. Okay, I'm not doing great. Uh, I'm gonna have to eat these spring onions. It's record. No, this is still like bugging me, but that's okay. We'll get through it. That's going to be the nose stream. I really hope I can get to the next level. Like, <laughs> I'm running a low on energy. I'm at level 49. I could just make a stair, I guess. I really don't want to have to use stairs though right now. I can just hit level 50. Oh, this is getting real sketch. Uh, you know what? I'm not taking any chances. Forget it. I hate to do it. I hate to burn through this much stone, but honestly... Yeah, I want to make level 50. Stairs at Paul. Alright. Tundra boots. What are tundra boots worth? Tundra boots, two defense, one immunity, which is better than what I'm wearing. Sweet. Okay. Well, we got five levels at least. Um, wow, it was really not great. But you know what? It's not a great luck day today either, so. Ooh, museum, you say. Uh, maybe I'll just go do some more fishing. Um, what do I need to take back with me to the house? Take that with me. Take that, that. That can stay here. Take that one, take that one. Ooh, I could go to the museum. Uh, museum closes at... Five. I wouldn't make it because I've got stuff at home I need to donate as well. Didn't think about that. Um, anything else? Can, is there anything else that can stay? I might just leave the bug meat in the chest. Leave the copper ore. Leave what's left to my stone. All right. I definitely could not make it to the house, and then. Uh, to the museum before 5 p.m. So maybe I'll just go drop off the few things I have at the museum, just cause. And then maybe we'll just do some river fishing or something. God, uh, the big issue is I'm just got too much stuff to water. That is the big problem right now. Cause by the time I finish watering, I'm out of energy. And then I'm kind of up a creek. So, um, it's definitely not ideal. I mean, the good news is that hopefully my farming level will go up sooner than later. And then I can get sprinklers unlocked. But, uh, I don't know. We'll see, I guess. Ooh, new reward. What did I get? Ooh, a starfruit seed. Nice. I definitely, definitely want that. Maybe I'll take all these seeds with me now, too. Yeah, let's do it. I mean, do I really want to plant nine cauliflower? Uh, yeah, I guess I could, actually. Maybe I will. I mean, it's free money. It's free money, basically. I've all got to water everything, but if I can, because cauliflower takes 12 days, so I'm going to have until the something. I'm going to check the garbage cans, but everybody's too close. Copper ores. Grab that. Don't know if I'm going to have 20 copper ores by the end of it, but good news. 
Yeah, I was going to trade the garbage cans, but everybody was too close there. Okay, so um, I'm not going to plant the cauliflower seeds now, but I will plant them before the 14th, 16th, something like that. Hold on, let me actually look. How late can I plant a cauliflower and still have it finish? Yeah, I can plant them by the 16th. Okay, so basically if my kale finish, I can plant cauliflower as well, and if they don't, then whatever. And we've got melons for later as well. The topaz I can sell now, I think. Why am I keeping a topaz? Probably for, for quests. One for a bundle, but the remix bundle, which I don't have. Uh, one for a quest, and that's it. So I'm only keeping one, so I can sell that quartz. Got a mixed seed I can plant as well at some point. We've got uh, these geodes I can crack open. Um, no idea why I'm keeping all this sap, but I'm sure there's a good reason for it. Standing geode. I don't think I can sell that, can I? No. Can I keep the copper bars, keep the iron bar? I need to upgrade my axe at some point too, so I should probably keep those in there. We've got those copper bars, and I think we're good. So I'm just gonna fish, I guess. I'll put my standing geode down somewhere, like there. And uh, let's go to the, uh, let me just see if I can fish on the farm. Um, where can I look, check that? That would be the, let's just look at farm. Farm maps, I am on the forest farm. Forest Farm says fishing 5%. Might catch a wood skip. So there's a 50% chance of catching a fish. And I could even catch a wood skip, which would be sweet. Um, take the one side of my nose. That's um, but it's affected by luck. So I probably shouldn't. Well, we'll just go to the river. The river's close. We'll just go to the river and. Do some fishing. Do some fishing for energy and for fishing XP. And so what's my fishing level at right now? Six. Oh, I need to get some crab pots going too, actually. Hmm. Fish front of Leah's house. Hey, what's up, Clayton James? How you doing? All right. Not great luck today. I think that affects fishing as well. At some point, I'd like to get a better fishing rod. Not sure why I'm going to do that. Got to save my money for tools and things. I'm not actually too, too worried about fishing. I would like to try and catch the legend before the end of spring, though. But I can wait till year two. Don't really need to f try and force the legend. Oh, I do need a sunfish, though. I'm pretty sure I need a sunfish for something. I think I need... I think I need sunfish anyways. I'll check here in a second. So I have to make sure I don't eat it. So today is the 10th. I need a rain day, actually. That's what I really need. I really need a rain day. Because then I can just go straight to the mine. I don't have to worry about watering anything. Go to the mine, have full energy food or not not have to like use any food to get through watering um yeah a rain day would be super useful but tomorrow's gonna be sunny so maybe the 12th hopefully oops although when am i turning my pickaxe in though on the 12th so hmm Hmm. Didn't have the great as great a start as I would have liked, but that's okay. We'll get through it. We've got two years. Everything should be doable without too much RNG stuff. Hey, there's Leah. Hello, Georgia Cole. Let me just quickly check and see what I need for sunfish. 
Uh, here. Sunfish, I need... Oh, I need two. For some reason, I don't think I kept any. So I just need to have two in the chest. I should actually update this, too, because now I've got... I think I have some extra leaks. And stuff. I'll have to check it out. Basically, what I'm doing on my spreadsheet is keeping track of what I need to have. So... If I've already, so like for a dandelion, for example, you need that, you need to put one in the community center. So, and I need to ship one. So you need, might need like five or six of them. But if I've shipped one already and put one in the community center already, then I only need three or four. So that's the kind of thing I'm doing on my spreadsheet is saying, how many right now do I need to have in my chest? Um, oh, that was close to being perfect. How many do I need to have in my chest right now for things that are happening in the future, basically? So that is the, uh, that's what that's all about. I wonder if I should just not eat any, just fish till I'm out of energy and not actually eat anything. Maybe cast one or two more times. Oh, or one more time. I hate to waste the day, like it seems like going to bed this early is a bit of a waste of the day, but... And I guess technically fishing is net positive when it comes to energy, because... I mean, I eat that bream and I could fish like two, three more times kind of thing. Hopefully catch two, three more fish and... Yeah, let's eat a bream. Or a chub. So I ate one fish, worth 45 energy. Let's see how much energy I catch. Let's see if I catch enough to make up for what I just ate. Or if I catch anything. You know. <laughs> I forgot it's not a great it's not great luck today. I probably shouldn't have eaten that. That's okay. That is a brew. 33 energy. So if I can catch one more fish, if I can catch one more fish before having to head back for the night, eating that chub would have been worth it. I might even go try to fish in the pond on the farm. Just so I'm a bit closer to home. Ooh, definitely worth it. What is this going to give me? Oop, missed it. There we go. Went right past the fish there. Nice. Frozen geode, very nice. Alright, let's head back to the farm, just so I'm a little bit closer to home. And, uh... I'll see what I need to keep of these fish. Sell the rest, I do need to start making some money here. Um, try the big pond, see if I can catch something. Or anything. I don't know if you can catch stuff in all the ponds, or... I'm not sure. No idea. All right, broken CD, good enough. Okay, so, uh, all right, I'm gonna ship. Uh, no, I'm gonna keep the Georgia Cola for food. What do I need for green algae? I know I need a bunch. So, green algae. I need four, five, ten, eleven. Need 11 green algae. I've got three. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have all the fish I need. I'm pretty sure. Because, like, what? Bream, chub, sunfish. I need to keep the sunfish. But bream... Bream and chub. 
So I know I've put one in the, in the uh, community center already. Need one for that recipe there. So I just need what? Oh, uh, what two? Maybe two bream or so. Is that what I have here? Yes. I need two bream, one chub. So I've got all those. So I might keep those for food. And then uh, keep that for when I have a recycling machine eventually. There's another geode. Rest is food. I really wanted, wanted to sell some stuff. I mean, I could sell... How much are the bream worth? Iridium quality bream. Worth 90 each. No, I'm Fisher with 112 each. I mean, it's going to help because I still got to pay for that tool upgrade. How much is... How much is... How much are chub worth? 93. I gotta, I gotta keep something for food, though. I just... I really need to keep some food stuff. Alright, this is going badly. This, things are starting to actually get bad now. Because <laughs> I'm... Uh, I need to get more money to upgrade my tool. I think I need like five grand or something. Oh no. I just realized I might have to sell some stuff. It is neutral luck today. I'll take it. Uh, weather report. More sun tomorrow. And it's going to be sun the next day because the next day is the egg festival. Hmm. Are my crops ready yet? Nope. Robin's axe. Okay, that's 250 gold right there. Gonna do that. Let me take another screenshot of my farm. There we go. All right, yes, absolutely gonna get Robin's lost axe. Where's my watering can? There it is. <clears throat> and while I'm down there, I'll do some foraging. I'll check for spring onions. Really looking forward to having speed grow as well. That's going to be a help. Oh, you know what else I was going to do? I was going to grab my axe and chop some of these things on the ground here so they don't uh, encroach on my, uh, on my crops. Normally, I'm, I'm so used to, like, if I have an open spot, like, make sure you plant something so you've got it. But now I'm just like, nope. Every crop I'm... Every crop I have planted is, like, a piece of energy I can't afford to spare. The good news is that when this kale is done, I'll be in a pretty good way. So I'll have lots of uh, farming. That's definitely going to boost my... Uh, my farming level. Um, and stuff. Alright, let's go get Robin's axe. That's 250 gold. Need to start raising some money for uh, to upgrade my axe, because I'm pretty sure the next upgrade's five grand, I want to say, isn't it? Tools, upgrades. Um... Upgrades. Uh, oh, here we go. Yeah, it's five grand. Oof, yike. How am I going to... I just might just have to... See, I've been trying to keep things so that I don't have to... You know what I'm going to do? I'm trying to keep things so I don't have to try and collect them later. But... Um, I'm trying to make sure that, uh, but I'm, like, I'm also trying to have the money I need to do stuff. So it's like, okay, well, what do I do? All right, here we go. So here is Cinder Sap currently. Let's hide the toolbar here. Uh, let's have a quick look for forageables. What do we see? Nothing. Seeing a whole lot of nothing at the moment. Whole, wow. Wow. There's like practically nothing. I mean, there's Robin's axe. There's three spring onions and that's it. Huh. Okay. Was hoping for more forgeables than that. That's okay. 
Oh, oh, traveling carts tomorrow as well. I should probably see what, uh... What traveling cart stuff is going to be available. Okay, let's head to... I guess we'll just head straight to Robin's. And then... Uh, Give her the axe, that's worth 250, and then we'll eat what we've got. And then maybe do some fishing and some mining and some whatever else. Uh, wait a second, where did I want to turn in my... Wasn't that today I wanted to turn in my pickaxe? I think it was. Because then I'll, I'll be without the axe for two full days. So I can be without my axe tomorrow. And the 13th, which is fine. And then the 14th, that'd be... Today's actually a good day. I'm going to turn in my pickaxe today, I think. Oh, there's a... I forgot there's forgeables on the farm. Yoink. Probably shouldn't have taken that with me, but whatever. Ooh, a leak. So, quickly into sea rob. I'm not going to be able to, for, to mine for very long. Oh, no, I, I can't turn my pickaxe. I don't have the money. That's unfortunate. All right, well, we've got that at least. Um, yeah, I don't have 5,000 gold. I can't upgrade my pickaxe. I wonder if I should just fish for money then. I mean, honestly, like, is getting down in the mines right now more important than just fishing for the money to upgrade my pickaxe? I don't know. I'm not sure. Yeah, I should I should just fish for money. It's not gonna I'm not gonna get five grand though. Uh but am I gonna get five grand mining though, either? Like that's probably not gonna happen. And I'm gonna be starving for energy. I'm just gonna fish. We'll start with fishing, then we'll see. Um Yeah, this is not great. I've kind of played myself into a corner here. Like I mean I could just go and sell a bunch of stuff. And take my chances. I'm like I'm sure I have five thousand gold worth of stuff. Then I would have to go and see Willy to sell the fish. Oh man, I don't know what to do. Okay, I mean I could turn my pickaxe tomorrow too. That's not the end of the world. So maybe what I'll do is I'll just fish for now. And then, um, I'll fish for now, and then, and then what? Don't know. Um, then tomorrow, I'll, basically I'll sell what I can today, like, energy be damned. I'll try somehow to make another three and a half thousand gold. If it was a rain day and I could maybe catch a catfish, I'd be a bit more confident. Um, maybe I just sell all my gems. Of course, I just put some in the museum. And like a topaz and emerald and stuff, or topaz and a aquamarine aren't really worth all that much. Um... If it's a multi-season, multi-weather fish, I could eat. I could either eat it or sell it. And like I say, I'm pretty sure I have all the fish I need for spring anyway. So any fish I catch, I think, except for like a sunfish, um, is fair game. I could do whatever with that. But I do kind of need to get down the mines a bit farther because I need to be able to unlock the mine carts. But getting down farther from the mines would be a way easier if I had a better pickaxe. 
So do I just suck it up and just go with a copper pickaxe? Or do I spend, do I save the money or, or make the money to upgrade it and delay getting the mine carts by a day or two? I feel like I need the pickaxe. If I was a better player, maybe not, but I think that I, I think I should probably do the pickaxe. Which means I gotta somehow scrounge up 5,000 gold. I mean, I could sell my copper bars. I do want to upgrade my axe by the end of spring, but not the end of the world if I don't. I don't actually need to be in, in the secret wood um, for a while. Like, I really don't. I don't need to be in the secret wood. Because, again, I can get the forgeables. I already have morels. If I can get a fiddlehead on the farm sometime in summer, that would be great. Um, so I don't think I need the secret wood. I don't really need the secret wood until I have a sweet gem buried to give to the stat old master cannoli to get this star drop. So... So yeah, maybe I'll be okay for the axe for now. Because once summer hits, I'll be able to... Um, once summer hits, I'll be able to... And I can... Oh, I'm not going to have them. Crap! I was just thinking, oh, once summer hits, I can, you know, I can plant star fruit and make more money, but I'm not going to have enough money to have unlocked the mine carts um obi-wan cannoli i'm not going to have enough money to unlock the mine carts to get to the desert to buy star fruit how am i going to do that i might have to just i mean a rain day would help um but I might have to just, uh... Ooh, prehistoric hand axe. I need that. I might have to just kind of give up on anything except mining. If I can get down the mines, then I'll get some gems and I'll get some stuff that I need to be able to sell to make some money to whatever. All right, what should I keep for food? Maybe... A chub and sell the rest. And I'll probably eat the green algae as well. Okay, so that'll be a little bit of money. Uh, let me see if I can. Is there anything else I can potentially sell here? Um, okay, do I need any more leeks or horseradishes? How many do I need to have in my chest right now? Uh, I need to have four leeks, two horseradishes. I've got two. Got four leaks, beautiful. I can mark that as green. I do need to have two more morels. But that's it for forge items. That's kind of that's kind of useful. Let me just check and see. Uh, I think this is today. Oops. For some reason, Windows is not letting me change file associations. Oh, there's a daff there's a dandelion over there. I could grab that and eat it. Um, is there anything else I can sell though? Like, what, what do I have in here I could, that I could sell? Maybe I could sell. Um, how much do copper bars sell for? If I need to sell that, and I've got a couple of iron bars as well. Oh, that really pains me. Um, all right, so. Copper bar. Copper bar. Oops, sorry. So copper bar is going to sell for 60 gold. That is not a lot. That's not worth selling. An iron bar is worth 120 gold. So I could sell that for 240. That's 360. That's 700 in total. 
I mean, I could crack the geodes because that's going to be well. No, because if I crack the geodes, I'm it's I'm just going to give me things I need to donate to the community center. I can maybe sell the spring seeds. So I'm not going to be doing anything with them. They're forgeables, but I don't need the forgeables. Like so, I can sell those. Um, the kale seeds I want to keep. The cauliflower I want to keep for money. I might just have to wait. I might just have to wait. Like, I just don't. And I still need to have some money to buy some, buy a few strawberry plants at the at the uh, spring, whatever, the egg festival. So, I might just have to wait. That sucks. So, I guess, um... I could head to the river. Maybe do some fishing at the river. Um, leave my iron bars there. So I will upgrade my. So I and I guess I may as well do some mining. Like I may I may as well just go up to the mine. I was gonna just do river fishing, but it's gonna take me a while to make that kind of make the kind of money I need to be able to upgrade the pickaxe. So I may as well just go to the mine, do some fishing. Maybe I can get five more levels in the mine. It's a neutral luck day, so you never know. And then tomorrow, I'll mine as much as I can. Um, oh, it's getting dark now. I just saw this whole screen change. Tomorrow, I'll mine as much as I can. And... Uh, Yeah. Okay, well, let's put that in there and put that in there. Let's eat what we've got. Just gonna eat it all, see how much energy I end up with. This will be worth a little bit. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, so... Do I bother fishing? I'm going to try it. Let's try it. Let's see if I can get five levels. Before I do that, though, let me grab my stone, because I think level 59 is a big swirly level. So, if if I get lucky and I make it that far... Um... If I make it all that far, it's going to be... I'm going to need to... Basically, at that point, I'm going to need to to stare. Get these bats going. Get them both in range. Go boop. There we go. Oh, a bomb. Nice. Ah, there we go. There's a ladder. Ah, this level there will be a ladder on, so that's good. Not even going to bother breaking any rocks, except for maybe a bit of iron. Okay, just going to ignore the baddies. I just got to get down as fast as possible. Ah, that up. There we go. Okay, well this is going pretty well so far. Looking for any baddies. There are none. Nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna bomb this. You know what, let's just do it. Nearly have enough stew. Goodness, yeah, this level's a big one. Probably shouldn't have bombed it. I mean, at least there are no baddies, so hopefully that's a good sign. Trying to be very judicious with my energy here. Although at some point I'm going to have to just start breaking rocks. Uh, you know what? I'm going to start doing screenshots. 
Because if there is an open ladder, I need to take advantage of that. Anything new? In fact, there's not much else on this level at all, so I should probably start breaking rocks. Hope for the best. I don't, I don't have any food, so... But again, if I can make one more level... Again, make one more level. We'll unlock it, have it saved. And... Uh, Oh, I hear a bat. Oh, there we go. Nice. Okay. There we go. Need to kill off the death sprites too. I can get a burglar ring so I can get more coal. But, it's 10.20 p.m. Throw in uh, a couple more iron bars. Leave those behind. Um, 10 p.m., I don't think I'm going to make it five more levels on the energy I have, but we got five levels farther than we were when we started. The rest of it can come with me. And we'll do a little bit more fishing for tomorrow. And uh, then we'll head back and that will be good. We'll be good for the night. Good for the good day in game. I might have to call it the night here as well. I do have to finish setting up my computer. I do have to be ready to work tomorrow on my computer, and I'm not right now, so... Gotta do that, too. Yeah, reinstalling Windows was... So here's a funny story about reinstalling Windows. What you can do is you can have Windows create a recovery disk for you. You can have it create a rec recovery media that it will put on a USB stick for you, which is great. And I recently rebuilt... Um, Diane's computer, and I still had the recovery media that I had made when I rebuilt her computer, so I thought, oh great, I'll just plug in that USB stick and and uh, use it to build mine. Got the same thing. Whoops. Because when you create recovery media from a computer, it adds whatever software the manufacturer puts uh, on the Windows image to that recovery image, um, which is why probably why Windows stopped just sort of saying, "Hey, here's an ISO you can burn to a CD and and uh, reinstall Windows." So I installed <clears throat> my desktop computer that I my sort of home built. Want to work? Want to bang on the drum all day? My you know home built desktop computer ended up with a bunch of random laptop stuff and McAfee and whatever else. So <clears throat> one of the most time consuming things was just uninstalling all the stuff that was installed by default. So yeah, I definitely recommend if you are thinking of getting, say, a new desktop computer, uh, I would definitely recommend, actually I'm going to try and catch one more here. May as well use, use up my energy. I would definitely, I prefer AVG. I don't use anything. <clears throat> I just use the default built-in Microsoft stuff. I mean, back, you know, 10, 15 years ago, 20 years ago, you definitely wanted to have a third-party program. But nowadays, Microsoft <clears throat> Defender is actually pretty good, all told. Um, but yeah, anyway, and plus, I mean, I'm, on my network at home, I'm behind a firewall and everything else, so it would be... It would be troublesome. No third-party antivirus. Um, so it's an extra layer of protection for some things, obviously not for everything, but um, as long as I'm careful with what sites I visit and that sort of thing, I should be fine. Okay, so I guess, do I bother selling the fish and stuff, or do I not? Don't know. I mean, I'm gonna sell the carp, obviously. Um, might keep the chub food, might keep the bullhead for food. Oh, looks like I'm keeping all of it then. Well, I shouldn't have brought the quartz with me, that was a mistake, that's okay. <clears throat> Alright, so, just quickly gonna go over here, we'll sell something, sell the carp. Keep the rest for food, I'm gonna keep the green algae in the chest. Still need some of those, and I think that is it, I think we're good. Let's go to bed, see how much money I managed to make.
Level 3 mining, very nice. Increases proficiency, which is awesome. So we made... Oh, nice! Oh, wow! We made 2,800. I only needed to make 3,600. Five... I'm 500 out? And I... And there's a potato ready. Okay, hold on a second. Let me grab a screenshot. For, oops, for later. There we go. Um, okay, well, I mean, that's... I'm going to do it. I'm going to make a point of scrounging up the 500 gold I need. All right, let's take some notes here. So, this is day 12. Let's go back to the next day notes. So, on day 12, we need to um, find 500G and upgrade pick. Um, what else? Got a water stuff. Um, water stuff. Water stuff. And then mine slash fish. Uh, fish for money. Ocean fish for money. Grab uh, iron bars so we can upgrade to a steel pickaxe. So we're going to do it. I did not think I'd be able to do it, but we're going to make it happen today. Uh, so ocean fish for money. So find fire go Okay, pick. Ocean fishing? So if I t basically, if I take the iron bars with me, go to the ocean and fish, sell the fish directly to Willy, shouldn't be a problem. Uh, money, 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 money. Money. Um... Grab the bars, water stuff, and do that, and then... Ooh, wait a second, though. Egg... Festival. Uh, egg Festival. Here's the problem, though. At the Egg Festival, we need to buy some strawberry seeds. How many, is the question. And is there a... Fortunately, there's no rare crow, so I don't have to worry about that. But I do need to buy some strawberry seeds. Um, come on, Commando. I seriously can't believe you. What can't you believe? Because I'm playing Stardew. Can you not believe I'm playing Stardew? Okay, so I need sturbities. What do I need strawberries for? Uh, oh, I just got to ship one. Oh. Okay, that's not so bad then. So unless I wanted to use strawberries for money, because they do sell quite nicely. But again, I'd have to water them. And I think it would be I think kale is better for XP straight up anyways. Do you believe in magic? So I might just get like one strawberry plant or two in case I get crowed. And then, so that's still going to be 200 gold, though. So I need to make sure I've got 200 gold left over. So I need 5,200 gold. Right now I've got 45. You were on my front page on Spotify? I was bumping you were going to work. So proud of you. What song? What? What song? Do you remember what song it was? It was probably. I'm guessing it was. It was. It was. If I had the chance, that's my guess. If I if I had to guess, it'd be if I had the chance. Um, was it an instrumental, or were there words? Because if it was instrumental, then I mean that narrows it down to like two. <laughs> um. Okay, five hundred. So I need. I actually need seven hundred gold. Seven hundred gold. Upgrade pick. Oh, sure, sure. And money left over for two strawberry plants. Grab the iron bars, water the stuff. Bang. Okay. Okay, that's the plan for the next time we play Stardew, which will be tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. Pacific time. That is when I'll be back live on Twitch on the Twitch.tv is playing Stardew Valley. We're going to continue on this run. We'll be playing Stardew Valley all this week, so um, prepare yourselves accordingly. The videos will be going on YouTube as well, so um, 
yeah, if you want to not, not, not watch the boring bits, let me rephrase that. If you want to not watch the, un, the hmm. if you want to watch it with some bits cut out um, and save yourself some time, that's where it's going to be. Um, but yeah, I'm out of here for the night. Before I go, let me say thank you to uh, Lee Hansen for the follow and Al Kearney for the host. It was instrumental. I got a little bit of Spotify to see the name. It was probably the song called If I Had the Chance, which, um, <clears throat> yeah, that song's actually been doing surprisingly well, considering I literally just threw it together for funsies. It's kind of embarrassing, actually. Um, unless it was the song called Two, in which case, that's the one that just came out recently. We'll talk about it another time. Anyway, the point is, I'm leaving. If you're watching this on YouTube, thanks very much. Uh, for everybody on Twitch, I'll be back tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, yes, thank you again to Lee Hansen for the follow and Al Kearney for the hosts. And uh, yeah, we got a few people here. We're going to do a little raid. So farewell, YouTube. It's been a slice. And uh, on Twitch, stick around for the raid. And we will talk to YouTube. I was going to say tomorrow, but whenever you watch the next video. Okay, bye, YouTube.